Matt, what a great storyteller. Mm -hmm. And of course, it's your story, so that made it really easy. No notes ever. That was amazing. It would have been really easy for me to write notes down just to make sure that I hit the key things that I wanted to talk about, but you didn't have to worry about notes at all. Your voice was very clear throughout. Everybody heard every word you said. You were engaging with the audience as you were looking around at the audience because you weren't looking at notes, you were looking at the audience. That was all very, very well done. And for the objective, we did get to know about you. We got to know that you went into the military early at age 17. <coughs> I thought you only got to do that in World War II, so I learned something myself. We learned a little bit about your, your, your family, your family was, was in the Navy. We learned that you were in North Carolina, Georgia. We learned that one of your favorite activities in the military was mowing lawns and cleaning toilets. <laughs> Still today. Still today. <laughs> And we, we learned a new word, Musculata? Musicala. Musicala. That's a city name. That's a city name. In Afghanistan. In Afghanistan. <laughs> <laughs> and we learned a little bit about fire support specialists. My suggestion for you would just be to be careful about your stage presence. I think you started with your elbow on the lectern. And you could have just started here. And your hands were, were together most of the time. So if you have a chance to think about where your hands are, you can just open them up. Open them up. And if you want to talk about cleaning toilets, you might <laughs> kind of shout cleaning toilets. You get a, get a little bit of humor. Or you might just leave your hands down by your side. You did appear very confident, however, even, even though your hand gestures would maybe indicate you had a little bit of nervousness. So that would be one suggestion. And when you actually went to look at your notes at the end, you could have just said, Mr. Toastmaster, when you were done, rather than <laughs> thank you, because we need to thank you. You did a, a great job, and we learned so much about you. Mr. General, <laughs> Evaluators. Both of our very piquant, piquant.